Good morning and welcome to Hollywood Studios on this wonderful May 4th. Also, for us anyways, make this a little personal, May the 4th is this lady's birthday. Oh, sorry. <laughs> but anyway, there's a lot of people here. So we're gonna wander around, look at some things. We've already had quite a busy morning. We went and seen Lightning McQueen did his racing academies. Hit the lights! Official racing people. Tower of Terror. Tower of Terror. We got terrorized. <laughs> then we decided to take a break, went to, uh, what is that? Tap line? Baseline. Baseline, baseline, tap, baseline tap, house. tap House. And now we're just gonna wander, wander about, and look at people. There's a lot of people here, so. And as we're hanging out down here on Grand Avenue, is this Grand Avenue? This is Grand Avenue, the old streets of America here. The future entrance to old Star Wars. Because it is May 4th, JR got him a lightsaber churro with some dark side chocolate sauce. Sweet. That's a tauntaun back there with that tail. That is a tauntaun. That is cool. That's what you slice open when you are on Hoth, the ice planet, and you crash land and you're freezing to that. You slice that animal open and you get in its stomach to stay warm. Star Trek? Uh, yep. Why don't you go to Gonzo's Royal Flush and ride that ride real quick? We're going in. So pizza Rizzo, not because we want some bad pizza, but because we're gonna get a cupcake, a special cupcake here today. We get a special cupcake today. There's a peanut butter and chocolate cupcake, which is going to be at Hopside Drive. This view is still hard to get used to, even though it's been here for a while. What is this, Grand Park? I don't know. But it's just it's hard to get used to, seeing it like this. That's changed for you. Oh, and it's really hot today. The force is out. That's sun. We're in line to meet Goofy. Maybe he'll cool us off with his cool moves. Oh yeah, it's her birthday. How's it going? How's it going? Good to see you. Man, you look awesome. Although it's a little hot for these uh, long sleeves, right? Maybe we should ditch this joint and make it over to Typhoon Lagoon. What do you say? Let's do it. Thanks, Goof. We'll see you around. He's totally stoked. He's totally stoked for this Typhoon Lagoon. He's totally stoked. Look, he likes her hair. What, what's, what's going on there? I think he likes it. That's interesting. Boy, Goofy's weird. Oh yeah, we decided to come on over to Toy Story Land and see what's going on, going on over here. It's pretty busy. Gotta say it's pretty busy. We have some alien swirling saucer action that we're gonna do later on tonight. For now, we're just kind of looking around, just looking at things, watching people. So it is May 4th, so may the 4th be with you. But we have seen some pretty good outfits out there. Sorry, I got distracted because there was a guy walking here right into that sign. It's right there, it's a pretty big sign, but he, he ran right into it. So, anywho, it is hot out here. The Florida sun is kicking. Speaking of cooling off, we decided to step into one man's dream. Look at this, everybody's got the same idea here. Some pretty cool stuff in here. Old desk. That's Walt's desk, apparently. You can tell by the pictures. This was always fascinating. This is one of Walt's stages. Look at that. Miniature. With lights and everything. It's a miniature diorama of old Granny's cabin. Hand built by Walt himself. Pretty good job he did. Look at that. Hand built, hand wired. 
Walter Elias Disney, the man who created all of this. Oh, look at this weird guy. This is the dancing man prototype. Come on. There it is. A little bit of that. This thing's pretty freaky and cool. Super complicated as we go around. Like you can see the bottom here. This is the control mechanisms. And as we go around to the back of this box, I don't know if you can see that or not in there, but it's pretty neat. We're gonna go sit in and watch an Aladdin preview, so this should be cool. Totally finished just watching that uh, Aladdin preview. Some uh, parkour, hardcore parkour in there. I forgot how much of a parkour is Aladdin was. Hardcore parkour. We're inside the Backlot Express. For some food, for snacks, treats, even. Oh yeah, maybe some of those right there. The old Mickey or Minnie Mouse celebration cake. I think that's what we're getting. Maybe a little bit of water to wash it down the old gully there. So it is hot out there. It's really hot. Well, all right, so my mistake. We weren't getting a cupcake. I was getting it. Jessica was getting a cupcake. Well, because, you know, it is her birthday, so it's only fair. But look at that thing. Looks pretty good. It's a it's a Mickey it's a Mickey birthday cupcake. Mmm. Not really a fan of the cupcake. I don't know. I guess I didn't do my research, but this is marshmallow. Not that good marshmallow though. Yeah, it's not that good. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of really me. Eh. Eh. Nothing against the dude, but he told me that it was a chocolate or a vanilla cake, and so I got it. I'm not a chocolate cake person. Fold. All right, so here we're over at the uh, Dark Side Diner. Subtext Dark Side Diner because supposedly they have here the Kylo Ren, Kylo Ren cupcake. There's no sign anywhere for it. I think you have to use the force to know if it's actually here. Apparently it's supposed to be here. Now it is time for sci-fi. Do you know the sci-fi? Shh, 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 shh. Say it with your breath. Oh yeah, we are in sci-fi. We're on all these cars, we're in our car. This is our car. JR's driving. But this is the sci-fi diamond. See, up there? Old sci-fi snack bar. See, it's got the little speakers on the side there, so you can, you know, hear what's going on. Look at the screen. We're gonna eat something. I don't know what yet. I think we might share. Gotta be quiet, because people are watching the movie. Gotta be very quiet. Just your inside voice. These movies are weird. What do you think we should get? The sure thing had fondue. I don't know if we should get the drive-in barbecue burger or the sci-fi barbecue platter. So, all right guys, in the comments below, we'll get whatever you pick. So, pick either the barbecue burger or the sci-fi barbecue platter. All right, you guys pick which one. We'll wait until you pick the one and then we'll, we'll do that. So, all right, one, two, three, go. Everybody go pick which one. So what'd you pick? Did, did you pick the drive-in barbecue burger or the sci-fi barbecue platter? No. What? Oh, the, oh, the platter. I, I, I heard you over there. I heard you over there, back there, for the barbecue burger. But I see the hands. I do see the hands and the... Um, yes, the... After calculating it, um, Barbecue platter has it, so barbecue platter is what we're gonna do. So, thanks guys. And the shrimp and crab fondue. And the shrimp and crab fondue. Also, uh, side note, I just wanna thank Jeremy and Kara for hanging out with us today. From the Magic Geekdom. From the Magic Geekdom, that was way cool. And Brock, from the Brockford Files. Mm -mm -mm. YouTube is weird. You just put yourself out there and you meet different people. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. But I think with them it worked. I think they're cool people. Like, I really like them. Hopefully they'll like us. <laughs> and we'll hang out with them again. But uh, anyways, if so, then we'll see you guys next time. Let's wait for that food to get here. We haven't even ordered it yet, so it'll be a minute for us. For you, right? Oh, looky there. That's uh, a nice blurry bit of food there. It's pretty dark, so it's hard to 
focus on it. This is our crab and shrimp fond fondue. Yes. So this is fondue. And then we got some chips, some little salsa chips in here. That's pretty good. Still got these weird things on TV. They're, they're cooking with magnets up there. So that's pretty interesting. Speaking of cooking, our food is here. Look at that. Wait a minute. Jessica's food is here. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> We're sharing. We're sharing this this barbecue plate that you guys picked. It's like coleslaw, some pulled pork, some jalapeno cornbread, a rib, right? Rib, some yes. beans, some chicken, and some chicken. We're actually going to share this, so that's why I got an extra plate here. So she's going to give me some of that food. I think she is going to share. Hope so. I better, I better stop filming, or I'm not gonna eat. Okay, so, going in. Happy birthday to you. Woo. All right. Thank you so much. Way I cool, that. man. Birthday cake shake. <laughs> Thank you. With a cupcake on top. That's pretty cool. It is really starting to droop there. That's so cool. Oh, we ate a lot of food. We just ate at Sci-Fi, Dine-In. All the food you guys picked and now it's time for Star Tours. I don't know if I can handle it. I don't know if I, my stomach can handle it right now, but we're gonna do it anyways. Cause uh, it is May the 4th, Jessica's birthday. May the 4th be with her. Walking into Star Wars, Star Tours. Are these the droids you're looking for? Attention, if you're going to Alderaan today, you're There's Akbar back there. Oh, it said James. That was weird. Is that me? For your safety, remain seated throughout your flight with your restraints securely fastened. And please watch your children. Thank you. This is the speeder we're looking for. Blast him! Told welcome to Tatooine. Anyways, it's not too busy here on Tatooine. Actually, it is. We're heading outside. We're done. If to we could, we're almost there. We've almost made it. We've almost made it outside. Almost made it. And oh man, Woo. made it outside. Whew. All right, just finished up the whole Star Tours after eating a heavy meal at Sci-Fi Dine-In. It actually wasn't that bad. We're walking down Hollywood, Hollywood Boulevard. But it was a good day. It's a pretty good day. We saw a lot of cool people. It was a nice, just chill day. The weather was pretty all right. You gotta thank Magic Geekdom for hanging out with us. Marvel at the Magic Brock from the Brockford Files. But anyways, we're out of here. So we'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for coming along. Far as we're concerned. Okay, okay, okay. One more thing, then we'll go. One more thing, then we'll go. We don't know how to call it quits. We just don't know how to stop. We don't know how to quit. Whoa! Holy moly!
Holy! Woo! Woo! Oh, man. We're really stressing that thing. We landed! Yay! That's pretty cool.